Greetings and salutations, I'm Keb. Welcome back to this Let's Play of Stellaris as the Smothershall Republic, where we're suffering starvation because of the migration routine. Ugh. Everybody moved to the same planet at the same time. Ugh. Almost makes the smaller planets better because <laughs> they can't get overwhelmed by immigration. Oh well. I'll get food eventually. We're building some farms now and... We'll just have to prioritize upgrading those farms. And then we can get our energy stuff up and running. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're very unhappy, I know. Because you're starving. I'm trying to fix that. It's gonna take a while. Hmm. All this influence, though. Maybe I should convert some of it. Grab a planet and increase the mineral gain, maybe. I mean, there should be policies for it. Policies. In terms of the global policies, there aren't really any that are particularly interesting. I mean, we're no longer serving stuff, so that's worthless. This one's good, but simply because of the happiness. Um, as for local edicts. Uh, farming subsidies on the starving planet could actually work, I suppose. Um, uh, we're not at a hundred, uh, we're at a thousand yet, so... We can wait a little while longer, I suppose. That's three cruisers on each planet. Not gonna upgrade that until the food situation is straightened out here. Gonna take a while. And meanwhile, we are getting the particle lances. For all I know, we might actually finish researching this before we even start the war. That I'm sort of planning. Sort of. I mean, we're still building up the fleet. And it's two cruisers. Wait a second, I thought I queued three. Okay. Oh, I did. So that's two more cruisers on each world. Then another five destroyers. And then battleships. Yeah, we're gonna have plenty of capacity for all that. Of course, all these massive fleets do take a lot of energy to maintain, though. That's not good. And right now I really wish I had the assist research thing, but ah oh well. Guess our science ships are gonna be worthless for the time being. Another cruiser for Camelot next. And we're getting enough energy so that we might actually be able to start terraforming. Again, I wanted 5,000 surplus. Just so I can immediately buy the next level of um, science boosters from the curators. Research complete. Um. I'll take that. Upgrade costs. Sure. I mean, we're gonna do that quite frequently anyway. Let's see, three cruisers. Oh, yeah, how many cruisers have I queued? <laughs> Me not remembering. Alright. Five cruisers here, so we're gonna need another one for Camelot. you done. I'm gonna need one more on Mother Shell. Mm. 
So are you still starving? Yes, you're still starving, but at least now we're fixing the situation. There we go. Once these are complete, you should no longer be starving and things should be honky-dory. to get all the other buildings up and running. In particular the power plants. in this world. That's science, right? No, that was one, one power square left. There we go. The rest, I think, are science buildings. And did we have one cruise left to QQ? Uh, I think we did. Six cruisers, three queued. Yeah, one more cruiser. Then another 10 destroyers, and then 10 battleships. 20 destroyers. And someone appeared more than someone. Uh, Rixi, that's over here again, I think. Somewhere. I thought it was. There we go, Rixi. Declares war on the associated what's-its. Okay. Wait a second, where put these in some big alliance webs? Yeah, he has... No, that's defensive pacts. Uh. They're in a federation, so I assume, yeah, they're not war. These guys are also at war. Yeah, well. Enjoy, people. Let's see, switch back to ourselves. Most people hate our guts. Go figure. I mean, you do a little bit of xenophobic purging and they get so upset. I mean, we've only purged a few planets. We've been very conservative in our purging. Uh, yeah, right, now we can terraform. I'm gonna go with this one first. Not exactly the best choice, I know, but... Uh, just so I can cl close down the frontier outpost and so it isn't in danger of being destroyed immediately. There are quite a few stations down there I'd like to keep, so... And there is the question of what we're gonna do with the fallen or the fortress thing. To fleet capacity, that's gonna take a while. <laughs> Still. We are gonna get there. I mean, the fleet is getting stronger and stronger here. Which I like. And we are researching steadily more and more tech, so it'll be, it'll be good. We're now how far ahead of you? Okay, now you're pathetic and inferior in tech as well. Very good. Uh, yeah, right. Armies for done. What about you? How far ahead of you are we? Inferior. Uh, you're still equivalent in tech. How dare you? I suppose that's because you have quite a bit of territory. I mean, you haven't settled these planets, but that's a lot of stars. Probably quite a lot of research stations and stuff. I 
31. Yeah, we might want to buy some policy things. Research complete. I'm gonna buy these two. Just so I don't hit the the cap without me noticing. Uh, da, 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 da. Well, that's nice, but yeah, let's go with the stellar warfare. Cheap attack. Just get it out of, out of the way. Destroy there, and then we are on towards battleships, I believe. And we'll still have fleet capacity to spare after that as well, so. Um, what's that? Democratic Pakata Nations. Oh! Is that you? No, it's not. Um. Okay. Well, that's fine. We've already surveyed everything we can, so. It's okay. If you want to explore a bit, that's fine. Someone who hates our guts, they're hostile, they're also a subject state. Wait a second, okay, so we can't... Research huh. Okay, so I'd have to close borders with you in order to close your subject state out. Is that what you're telling me? Oh, and that's the little... That's the little tyke down here, isn't it? Yes, it is. Oh, well. Um, let's see. A couple of things. That was done. Advanced rail guns. Or swarm missiles. Anti-point defense gun. Oh, you know, let's try that. that sounds cool. Plant terraformed. Really? Um, okay, so where the heck are you? There. I need a colony ship then. Oh, that's close to Sikon. And this should be our Default species, right? Yeah. Yes, it is. So. Let's get that going. Beyond that, we pretty much have to save up the minerals for battleships next. I mean, they're gonna take a while to build. <laughs> Oh boy. I mean, we did get the Fleet Academy, but I don't think I want to replace anything with it. Yeah, because that apl only applies to ships that are built after you get the Fleet Academy up and running, so... I don't know. I mean, the ships are going to be better, but... Oh, yeah, uh, an election. Um, I'd say we keep the guy we have. Cruiser build cost, though, that's interesting. Slaver, not so interesting. Oh, 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 oh. oh my.
very tempted on this one. Uh, but he's old. But still, uh, terraform cost. How much would it cost me to support him? That would take quite a lot of influence to get him above 39%. And we'd have less influence gain. But that would be so valuable for all the terraforming we're doing. And you're 87, so yeah, you're pretty old. You're not going to be able to build any mines anyway. Okay, let's do one support just to see. Okay, 13%. We need to sink like 300 influence in order to get him. Uh, I quit it. I want, it. I want him. Okay, that's two times. Three times. Four. There we go. Oh my goodness. It's gonna eke out a victory at this rate. That would be so... No, one more. I need to be sure. There we go. I mean, that terraforming reduction. Given the number of planets we can currently terraform, it should be a significant energy reduction, so I think it's gonna be worthwhile. We're about to find out. I mean, we spent... Situation log updated. There we go. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, let's find some big, big planet. <clears throat> like uh, this one. Which is on a frontier outpost world. Terraform you into a continental. That's going to cost 1750 instead of 2500. Yeah. Much better. I'm going to save quite a lot of energy doing that. Now. So I think it's going to be. I think that's going to pay off. Now I have the ob orbital research mandate, and we can't really do anything with that. With that. <coughs> Given that we have no stations to build. <laughs> oh well. Trying to understand how this whole nest works. You are a vassal under the Kaveli Union. Kaveli Union are a <laughs> guaranteed by the their overlords. I'm really starting to wonder what happens if I declare war on this these guys. How the whole chain works, but it doesn't really matter. We're gonna go head on with this guy first and basically purge our way around and then we're gonna go and have fun down here, I suppose. We'll see. I mean, they wouldn't have any fleets left at that point. Construction complete. But that's still in the future. Oh, that should be the colony ship that was finished. Yes. Shining City. You're gonna go straight over here. Oh, do I have to drag you or something? Well, um, colonize from yeah, they, like the ship. Oh, there we go. Ugh. Uh, da, 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 da. Yeah, where would we get the most out of the adjacency stuff here? A lot of crappy squares. Da, 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 da. Um. Oh, fine, let's go there. Only three adjacencies, but they were all energy. And it was a good base square, so it'll work out. Time to queue another battleship, I 
think, if I can just click right here. Research complete. Da, 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 battleship, there we go. Need to give another one here too, if we have the minerals. Another naval capacity upgrade. Uh, get that tech out of the way. This one should have, yeah, yeah, plenty of cues. Things queued up still, but. All oh, right, now we're out of minerals. But we still have a pretty darn long queue, so. Shouldn't run out of things to build just yet. choose. Uh, the physics. We're still short of physics. And right, when you were just short of minerals again. Give me minerals. Give. Save up for more battleships. And let's see, next terraforming target, what's that gonna be? I mean, there must be some large, large planet somewhere that's just waiting to be terraformed. Settling down that one is probably gonna be a bad idea, then the fallen empire is gonna react. And not in a good way. Size 24, that was pretty good. Quite a few large planets out there. Yeah, well, we'll get them all in due time. Research complete. Particle lenses, woohoo! And oh, even better point defense. Uh, shield gen that's nice, but not exactly what I want. I mean, this is just yeah, the reactors. We need them. If we're gonna part, uh, if we're gonna power up the party glances, we're gonna need some pretty hefty reactors. So I'm not gonna change my ship designs until I have that reactor thing. We kind of need it to have any chance. Let's see. There was a size 22 somewhere up here. There we go. Oh, you're already being terraformed. Never mind then. Um, there was a size 22 somewhere in this area. Right, I just started terraforming you as well. Uh, the arid size 24 here then, I suppose. Keep minerals, I need to queue up another ship. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, 
Oh yeah, the curators. I forgot about those. Um, do you, didn't you also give me some clues of how to kill the Wraith? We did encounter that on the far side of the galaxy, so we can't really meet it again, but... Um, oh, I didn't buy all the text for it. Blue Wraiths. Systems with blue giants. In B stars. Oh, okay, so you have to fight them in star systems that correspond to their color. Uh, that sounds like quite the challenge. Research complete. We don't have the robot tech at all, but do I want to research it? Uh, I do. I'm gonna build one robot pop, maybe. Just for your achievement, because I don't have that one. <laughs> I have not cared so much about robots Research in this complete. game. You're all implants, that's a slave army. Uh... Ability isn't necessary. Oh, sure, we'll take the Xeno Cavalry. Not particularly something we need, but it was a purple tech, and that means I want it. And uh, the new colony was founded. I don't know if they immediately started building a space station, they did. need for us to spend minerals on that then. Uh, we still need more battleships. How many have we, have we built now? We built... Okay, that's three. Four about now. That's five queue there. Six, seven. So I need to queue at least three more. Then we'll have two pretty darn sizable fleets. And we'll still have room for more. I think I'm going to build those two fleets, and then I'm going to go and visit the Enigmatic Fortress. I just want to see what that's about. And hopefully two fleets of 20k should be enough to deal with it, I don't know. I mean, this, the science ship lasted for a sec fraction of a second, so I can't actually tell how strong the fort was. And speaking of, we never actually did the encounter there, because we weren't the first one to arrive, so we didn't get an encounter event. I suppose I could send an assigned ship just to have a look. I mean, I don't particularly need them, so why not? Let's send in the eminence. Oh, yeah, given our election, did we get a free leader? Uh, no, they're all pretty busy. We, there was a sci scientist from the ship we just sent out that got elected, but it doesn't look like we got a free leader. Oh well. Okay, I think it's time for another short break, and then we'll see if we can visit the Enigmatic Fortress next time. Thank you for watching, 